This is going to be a demonstration on how Protostar Alarm Monitoring and Alarm Link Labs reporting, how does it show up and what do we do when it shows up, specifically for Alarm Link Labs, and how do we clear it from Link Web, Link Web for Alarm Link Labs. So I am going to be demonstrating both of those in this video. So first we're going to demonstrate Protostar Alarm Monitoring and then as soon as that, as soon as I show you that, we're going to move straight over to Alarm Link Labs and how to clear your alarms in Link Web. So I'm going to start off here with a panic alarm on my Bosch B5512 alarm panel. So I'm going to start by hitting Command 9, which is a panic alarm. So we're going to do that. And as you can see on my screen, which I have OBS running so you can see it, but you can see right here, we have a panic alarm. And now it shows point nine oh one keypad one area one panic alarm. And now we're gonna show you what it looks like in link wink link web. So here it shows the date, count number, the name of the account. We got what zone it was and the type of event, which is panic. And this is the description, keypad one. So you're gonna hit handle. And right here, you got your contacts list, which if you're on our phone system, you can click on this and it would open up the phone software and then you could dial this. This is on a private network called Tandem X. I will have a link to that in the description of this video, as well with links to Protostar and Alarm Link Labs. So once you're here, you can see the event history of that specific account. And you can see that here. And then when you go to clear, you go to the disposal code, just click on full clear and hit complete. And then that's your alarm cleared. Then you can go to completed traffic and see your alarms. You can see the exact same info as here. And then you can see who cleared it and what computer it was done on. So for me, my user ID would be CPL and the computer is web as I'm using link web. And that's basically how link web works. I am gonna demonstrate it again, but with a fire panic this time. So we're going to do command seven, which is the fire panic. Silence that. And let's clear it. Now, you're going to see we got a fire alarm from here and also a fire cancel. Now, we are going to go and go in here and we're going to hit handle and do it the exact same way that it was done before. Full, clear, complete. And I have two events as it's sent to cancel. So we're gonna do full, clear again and hit complete. Now, that is pretty much it. There's nothing else really needed to do. But yeah, that is our demonstration for Protostar Alarm Monitoring and Alarm Link Labs Link Web. Hope you enjoyed the video.